All right, guys, we're finally back. This is buyer tip video number eight. And in this episode, we're talking about land transfer tax. Let's run it. So land transfer tax applies in essentially three separate situations. When you buy a house, when you buy a condo, and when you buy a plot of land. When you buy, for example, a trailer that's on lease land, you won't be applied land transfer tax as the land is essentially not changing hands between buyers. So before I throw up the scale on how land transfer tax is actually calculated, I wanna talk a little bit about closing costs. In closing costs, most people think that the lawyer is the most expensive part, but in reality, it's not. It's the land transfer tax. So now you're thinking to yourself, hey, how is land transfer tax actually calculated? I'm gonna throw the scale up right here. But to break it down a little bit, the first $30,000, you don't pay any tax on it. Easy enough. From $30,001 to $90,000, you pay 0.5%. From $90,001 to $150,000, you pay 1%. From $150,001 to $200,000, you pay 1.5%. And then every $200,000 after that, you pay 2%. So it's a bit of a sliding scale, not super difficult to understand, but something you gotta know. So that's it for today's video. I know it was a little bit of a short one, but I give you the basics on land transfer tax. Remember, it's one of the most expensive closing costs associated with buying a house. So you gotta know it in and out. And if you enjoyed the video or you found it helpful, please like the video. Please go subscribe on YouTube. Please go follow me on Instagram. Go connect with me on LinkedIn. You guys know it, the whole thing. And I hope these tips help you. Love where you live.